Hi, my name is Gonzalo Del Monte Nieto and welcome to the Del Monte Nieto Lab. We are located in the Australian Regenerative Medicine Institute in Monash University. In the Del Monte Nieto Lab, we are developing really exciting research to understand how the heart development happens during embryonic development. Uh, in, with these interesting and, and exciting results, we are not only uh, trying to understand basic and fundamental science, we are trying also to identify potential causes for congenital heart disease or new therapies for cardiac regeneration. So, have a look. Here, in the dissecting room, is where we prepare all our embryonic samples uh, to have them ready for molecular and molecular and, and morphological analysis. The lab is formed by developmental biologists specializing in embryo development, but also in imaging and image analysis. Over here, we have what we can call our artificial uterus because it allows us to culture embryos in optimal conditions and allows physical manipulations to help us a lot in answering our research question. Once we have all our embryos ready and our embryonic samples are ready for the analysis, we, will, we need to move to our lab area where the molecular and morphological characterization happens. Follow me. Here in the lab area is where the main experiments in the lab happen. We are performing morphological and molecular analysis of how the heart forms in a normal embryo but also identify the heart defects that appear when we modify genetically or pharmaceutically uh, our embryos. This fundamental research uh, is not only helping us to understand heart development in general, it's also allowing us to identify potential factors or risk factors that can cause uh, heart disease in babies or adults. Furthermore, understanding how uh, cell behaviors happen and are regulated during heart development is allowing us to identify new interesting insights about heart regeneration and how we can improve our regenerative capacity uh, that is completely lost in, a, in the adult heart. This is very important because it will allow us to identify new potential treatments for um, heart attacks that is one of our main uh, killers worldwide and in Australia. In order to streamline our studies, the lab is also performing and developing new imaging and image analysis methodologies to be able to perform our research. With the help, expertise and technology of the MONAS Microimaging and MONAS Biomedical Imaging uh, platforms, the lab is developing new methods for imaging to be able to analyze the developing heart and also the adult heart. These new imaging methods require the development of new image analysis methods. On this regard, the lab is developing um, very automatized image analysis pipelines with the help of computer science uh, experts and uh, approaches involving uh, machine learning and deep learning networks. To generate these uh, image analysis pipelines, the lab is benefiting from the world-class uh, supercomputer capabilities present at Monash, and in particular, Massive, that is the Monash supercomputer. Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoy the, the tour in the lab and the important work that we do here, and I will see you next time. Ciao.